Hey guys, I haven't been vlogging for a couple of days already, Monday and Tuesday. So this one will be posted on a Thursday. I do have one more vlog that I haven't really edited yet. So I just want to give you an update. The reason why I haven't been vlogging since, what, Monday, that is because I've been busy, um, preparing reports for poultry plus yesterday was also my father's birthday so um there were a lot of errands to run but um yeah i'm glad i'm back again um yeah probably i will not be doing this more often this time because i'll be busy in a couple of days um we are actually starting to expand so slowly we haven't had the expense yet i mean the finance yet but uh we are really hoping for the best but meanwhile um there were still a few mortalities in the farm so really cannot avoid that um yeah this is the reason why we really want to grow out um rtls or from chick to rtl that is because you know you really cannot trust everything from your supplier of your ready to lay chicken so as much as possible we will try our best to let the chicken grow that is because um it's way more better when you know how they grow out second thing is that um, it's easy for us to expand because it's cheaper to start from chicks or what they call day old uh, pullets and let them grow rather than buying them from a supplier because as you may have already know in our province the range of a 16 week old chicken is between 450 to 480 so it depends on which area you're from if you have to you know buy a thousand chicken then that would cost you about well in our case we paid for about 470,000 pesos so it's a lot of capital though it was you know it was ready to lay that's that's why they call it rtl the problem with that you don't really know how they grow out their chicken and at the same time it is it is expensive as a beginner still okay to start from you know from rtl or ready to lay chicken and that way we already have a background so but since this time we are a bit confident already what's good about being in this day and age is that you know, the, there are a lot of um, information already available online so you don't really have to be physically there in an actual farm instead you can just watch online especially right now um yeah one of the reasons why i'm also busy is that i've been learning online checking blogs you know vlogs are actually very helpful especially when you are learning something and most of the time farms also have different ways of um, dealing with things depending on their situation so you can always um, weigh things and you can always learn from other people's mistakes and other people's experiences so yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. I am learning as much as I can so that when we are already raising the chicks, then we're a bit ready already. I can't say we will be 100% ready because, you know, again, uh, we are a beginner here when it comes to growing out chicks. And at the same time, we are still trying to build the brooder house. So yeah, it takes so much money, effort, and time for us to be able to raise um, day-old pullets to ready-to-lay chicks. 
but again i believe it will be worth it because at the same time um, we will also learn a lot so yeah that is the plan for now i'm sorry if i was not able to really update you guys as to what's happening to my uh, vlog and what's happening to me but we're still okay actually i just want to give you an update as well um the prices of eggs here are super duper high now there's so much demand of eggs already um we're sh running short of eggs already but unfortunately we have already given up our plans of getting supplies from other farms like cebu because um apparently they really could not give us our um the numbers that we really want so we've been wanting to actually get 400 to 800 trays per week but then they really couldn't supply us the trays that they've only given us uh last delivery was only 100 trays it was supposed to be even 85 so out of 400 they only gave us 85 trays which cannot even cover the expenses so we have decided, my husband and I decided that we are not going to um, continue this, uh, you know, this buying and selling of eggs anymore. What we're going to do is just we're going to um, focus on building or the expansion of the poultry farm. So I guess that will be it for now. And thank you guys so much for all your support. Probably um, next few weeks, you will see me and the farm more often because um, we will start building our um, next poultry house. So until then, I'll see you. Bye.